Thank you for visiting Litson RV and for the opportunity to unveil for you the all new Winnebago Mini Winnie and Spirit 26T, now equipped atop the safety enhanced Ford 7.3 liter V8 chassis, the nimble double slide out with a walk around queen bed available here at Litson RV. America's closest dealer to Winnebago Industries. We're located only one mile north of the Winnebago factory, based right here in Forest City, Iowa, and recently named by the manufacturer, Winnebago Industries, as the North American top dealer for sales volume across all of the motorized coach divisions of Winnebago Industries, based right here in Forest City, Iowa. But reaching out across all of North America for that top sales volume award, now for the past five consecutive years. However, most importantly, be the first to break in and protect your new Ford 7.3 liter V8 in accordance with the way Ford Motor Company outlines inside their owner's manuals, in which there certainly is a definitive break-in procedure, in which they recommend, if possible, no towing for the first thousand miles and varying your speeds to break in and seat those cylinders in that Ford 7.3 liter V8, as opposed to the way a delivery driver may and do tow their own personal vehicle out to your local dealership. Be the first to break in that new powertrain, sleep that first night in your walk around queen bed, and eat that first meal in your factory fresh U-shaped dinette in the Mini Winnie and Spirit 26T available here at Litson RV. It's here and now equipped with the new safety enhanced 7.3 liter Ford V8 chassis, this new nimble on the go length double slide out Winnebago Mini Winnie 26T and its identical twin, the Winnebago Spirit, both of which we offer here at our dealership, being one of the few full line dealerships here in North America so we can provide you that unbiased opinion. The two are identical all the way down to features, quality, content, price, and colors. This is a Highline Class C Touring Coach with two slide outs, a walk around queen bed, a sofa bed, and large U-Lounge dining area. Now loaded with many standard features that were previously optional, there is no better way to jump into or continue your RV lifestyle than in the Winnebago Mini Winnie and its identical twin, the Spirit. Not only are both built to Winnebago's legendary construction standards that include the superstructure construction in the sidewalls and roof that will cover as we walk through the outside and the inside of this coach, it also includes standard features such as LED lighting, a multitude array of USB charging ports, and a large basement storage area. The Winnebago Mini Winnie and its identical twin, the Winnebago Spirit, are both built atop the Ford Class C cutaway chassis, the E-Series, marking 58 consecutive years of production for the RV industry. This all new 2021 model year chassis is built with the new Ford 7.3 liter dual valve free breathing V8. This is the premium rated engine calibration used by Winnebago Industries and it is not the optional downgraded economy based 7.3 liter V8 used by other competing RV manufacturers which offers 10% less power than this version used by Winnebago Industries. The new 7.3 liter dual valve V8 engine is 30 pounds lighter and 20% smaller than previous Ford V10s and offers better fuel economy. Now based in its second year of production, the 7.3 liter dual valve V8, nicknamed Godzilla by auto manufacturer aficionados, boasts 468 pounds feet of torque or power. It includes 350 horses, made it up to the Ford Torque Shift, six speed automatic transmission with great braking capabilities. This configuration allows the coach to operate at lower RPMs while maintaining set speeds, thereby offering better fuel economy. Neutral idle also allows for lower RPMs and better fuel economy. Performance enhancements include the new twin I-beam front suspension for a solid foundation and weight dispersion. The new 2021 model year chassis Ford V8 used by Winnebago Industries also now includes the new safety enhancements which are included in Ford's Smart Driver Assist technology 
and are based within every Winnebago Class C Mini Winnie Spirit and includes the following new safety enhancements. Adaptive Cruise Control. Adaptive Cruise Control employs both radar and camera technology to set a cruise speed and distance from the vehicle in front of you, an especially helpful feature in slower traffic conditions. When traffic ahead slows, you automatically slow as well. When it picks back up, you can resume your present speed and distance. Also included in the driver assist technology package is active distance alerts, providing and maintaining the distance to the vehicle ahead of you and adjusts itself based on the movement of the vehicle ahead. Forward collision warning alerts you if it senses a potential collision, displays a flash in the instrument cluster, and increases brake assist sensitivity to provide full responsiveness when you brake. Lane departure warning uses a camera mounted behind the windshield to scan road lane markings and detects an unintended lane departure during the day or evening. When activated, this alerts you in the display and provides audible warnings. Driver alert recognizes repeated lane departures as a sign of fatigue and issues visual and audio alerts that it's time to pull over and take a break. Automatic emergency braking. Automatic emergency braking provides an audio alert, displays in the instrument cluster and precharges and increases brake assist sensitivity to provide full responsiveness when you brake. Post impact braking. Post-impact braking can potentially lessen the severity of a secondary collision by automatically applying moderate brake pressure when an initial collision event is detected. ESC or Electronic Stability Control senses when you begin to lose traction and automatically applies selective braking to help prevent your vehicle from sliding or skidding. Traction control applies selective braking to keep your wheels from excessively spinning and helps maintain traction. Hill Start Assist activates the anti-lock brakes for up to two seconds as you transition your foot from the brake to the accelerator pedal. Also included by Winnebago Industries within the Ford Class C cutaway platforms are tire pressure monitoring, automatic headlamp activation and automatic high beam control driver monitoring, remote keyless entry, and an airbag cutoff on the passenger side. Safety enhancements also include three-point safety belts as well as dual front airbags. We'll also touch on as we walk through the inside of the Winnebago Mini Winnie and Spirit, the all new Sony 8.95 inch infotainment radio that does include color rear view camera monitoring and then ties in nicely with the side video camera monitoring as well as light duty automotive car and truck amenities such as Sirius XM satellite radio ready, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth hands-free calling, Bluetooth music replay, and also voice activated GPS commands through Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, and the Sony infotainment radio comes with a three-year warranty. The Ford Motor Company warranty provides a complete extended powertrain warranty for five years or 60,000 miles, whichever occurs first, and a complete bumper to bumper warranty for three years or 36,000 miles, whichever occurs first. This does include Winnebago's patented steel superstructure components. The cab design surrounds the cab bunk area within the sidewalls and the roof, providing a sturdy steel framework. The seats and safety belts are all bolted into steel. Appliances and cabinetry are mounted to steel. The steel firewall protecting the engine from the passenger components is provided by Ford Motor Company. And then interlocking joints evenly distribute the weight of the roof along the entire span, span of the wall. So in theory, an empty shell could be built, whereas competing manufacturers do rely upon internal sidewall structure, such as the living room component walls that separate the bedroom to provide their structure. Up top here, you'll see an aerodynamic low profile molded front cap that doesn't sacrifice the interior overhead bed sleeping at 57 by 95 inches. 
Again, with this being the new safety enhanced Ford 7.3 liter V8 chassis, this does have automatic headlamp control and automatic high beam control. Working our way around then towards the driver's side, you'll also see safety enhancements such as three point safety belts, dual front airbags. We also include standard now rear auxiliary air springs that will gravitationally move the weight from the rear axle to the front axle weight rating. This is on the upgraded 14,500 pound gross vehicle weight rating and chassis from Ford Motor Company. So it boasts nearly 2,900 pounds of occupants and cargo carrying capacity of which then you would reduce for people, cargo and any fresh water that you may travel with in transit. You can see the first of two slide outs with the latest in slide gear technology. This is the power gear slim rack system. We have included the factory installed option of dual pane thermal insulated windows and the solid foundation down below of HWH automatic hydraulic leveling jacks. Inside each of the chromed side mirrors, each of these will piggyback against the sidewall if necessary, the top two thirds of which are powered and heated. The lower one third includes the convex parabolic wide angle technology. And then down below is the side video camera monitoring system that ties in nicely to the 8.95 inch infotainment radio with the integrated color rear view camera monitoring system. So a total of three individual security cameras, but each of the side cameras articulate off of the turn signal column. Here you'll find 16 inch wheels with stainless steel wheel liners. Just behind here an easy to access assist step or running board. And then down below you'll see the first of four individual jacks for the HWH computerized automatic hydraulic leveling system. This is a factory installed option that is on this 26T. Not only do we maintain nearly 2,900 pounds of occupants and cargo carrying capacity, we also maintain a 7,500 pound factory installed rear tow package. And again, with those rear auxiliary air springs, you can gravitationally move the weight from the 9,600 pound rear axle weight rating to the 5,000 front weight rating. Here you'll find the Cummins Onan 4000 watt micro quiet gasoline generator that sips fuel off of the top three quarters of the 55 gallon fuel cell. This fuel capacity inside this tank then is sized to power everything inside the coach off of that Cummins Onan 4000 watt micro quiet gasoline generator simultaneously without throwing a breaker. Here you'll see 30 amp shoreline service again sized to power everything inside the RV simultaneously without throwing a breaker. You'll also see the sheen coming from the e-coating process. After a multi-million dollar infrastructure upgrade, this is the latest in multi-stage full immersion electro coating system. It helps to minimize corrosion and it's also used by leading automotive manufacturers such as General Motors, Ford, Acura, and Honda to protect their vehicles from corrosion. As we continue on with the black tank flush, Going a little bit further into e-coating, this process involves charging each metal plate to an electrical charge which attracts the protective coating, causing it to be evenly plated onto the part, providing a uniform thickness of protective coating. There you saw the black tank flush, the fuel fill, and then also resort or portable satellite inputs with the coaxial inputs. Also the tank fill for the 50 gallon freshwater capacity as well as the city fill so that if you are hooked up to pressurized city water, you have that water pressure not having to use your water pump. Again, 50 gallons of total fresh water capacity in the coach. The drainage system then includes draining the 35 gallon black tank. You can then hook up to that black tank flush to irrigate out that 35 gallon black tank and then complete your drainage of the 39 gallon gray tank with your waste hose to cleanse it out. A nice sneak preview there to the plank style upgraded bow floor vinyl flooring that's used throughout the coach. This coach does have a tremendous amount of basement storage with 45 cubic feet of basement and exterior storage even in a double slide out coach. Here you'll find the T-valves and the hydraulic leveling pump reservoir for the HWH hydraulic leveling system. And then again the latest in three and a half inch oversized PVC technology for all of our seamless one piece rotocast tanks for that 35 gallon black tank, the 39 gallon gray tank. And then again, using that non potable water hose, you can irrigate out 
that black tank and complete the drainage of that 39 gallon gray tank. Great pass-through storage here in the rear trunk. Again, all of these areas being e-coated in the latest in e-coat process with that charging plate process with the multi-million dollar infrastructure upgrade here at Winnebago Industries. As we zoom out, you'll see we've ordered this Coach Factory Fresh. This is the champagne sidewall with the beige accents. This provides the appearance and durability of a full body base coat, clear coat, automotive finish, yet it saves that nearly $9,000 upgrade for full body paint. You'll also see the second slide room that houses the walk around queen bed. Again, with the latest in slide room technology, standard up top, of course, are the slide room awnings. To the rear, a beautiful one-piece fiberglass end cap, and then also a rear ladder that brings you up to Winnebago's patented one-piece laminate block foam roof with the fiberglass membrane up top. We'll cover that in detail here in a moment. The exterior rear ladder is a great option to have. It is standard on the coach, but it's a great feature to have in the event that you want to store anything up top to inspect the seals on your roof. Although here at our dealership, we do that complimentary at no charge anytime you bring your RV in. To the rear here, you'll see the exterior rear view camera monitoring system. During our quality pre-delivery inspection with our master RV IA certified technicians, we'll set that one car length back from the toe of the hitch platform to the rear in the event that you do any dinghy on the ground towing. A beautiful exit window here to the rear with a wonderful view out of your master bedroom and of course that is also a dual pane thermal insulated window working down that one piece fiberglass end cap very easy to maintain with this champagne dyed fiberglass very easy to cool very easy to maintain an automotive style bumper includes a storage location for your drainage hose and then down below a 7500 pound factory installed tow package as well as the factory installed upgrade that we've added to this coach of the rear spare tire. You can also see the cross rail for the HWH automatic hydraulic leveling jacks. Also within this two inch receiver and the 7,500 pound factory installed tow package, we also then include the seven blade bargeman wiring harness. Working throughout this coach, you'll see all of the attention placed towards smart space design. Using computer-aided design, this ensures a precise fit for all components and reduces wasted space. With Winnebago manufacturing its own holding tanks, we can then size and shape them to fit precisely into the space allotted. It actually frees up surrounding space for additional storage. As we work our way up, unlike any dealership here in North America, we're gonna elevate up to show you Winnebago's patented one piece laminate block foam roof and a nice stink preview there of the powered 17 foot side patio awning that does include LED lighting. This is Winnebago's patented one piece laminate block foam roof with the fiberglass top. This is a 10 year warranty providing strength and longevity. The only maintenance to this is inspecting the seals around the skylights, vents and side coves. Working away from the rear to the front, you'll find the skylight for the oversized 24 by 32 inch shower, several different vents, whether that be inside the bath, the master bedroom, or within the kitchen or galley area. A ducted high efficiency Coleman Mach 15,000 BTU high efficiency ducted air conditioning system is located mid coach. Forward of that then is the omnidirectional local off-air high definition antenna that allows you to bring in your entire free local off-air high definition programming from inside the 2060. Since it is a fixed mast antenna, you no longer have to worry about cranking that antenna up, but more importantly, forgetting to crank it back down. You'll see the vent for the overhead cab sleeping area, and then also the cuff antenna for the Sirius XM satellite radio upgrade that we've added to this coach. This includes the rooftop mounted antenna and the tuner that controls the infotainment radio. The radio itself is Sirius XM satellite radio ready, but this then provides the actual antenna and programming into that infotainment package. Also, we can install any type of connectivity enhancement for Wi-Fi or cellular boosting. So be sure to check out our connectivity 101 videos in our video library on Litson.com, as well as several archived Litson RV live experiences 
in which we walk you through live, take your questions live, the dual types of connectivity enhancements for Wi-Fi or for cellular boosting. We can also custom equip any type of a solar package since there is plenty of rooftop real estate up top here. The main purpose of that then would be to power the dual Deep Cycle Group 24 RV batteries. And as we wrap up atop this one piece laminate block foam roof strong enough to step across, store additional items, we'll work our way back down towards the patio area and wrap up with a balance of 45 cubic feet of basement and exterior storage. Again, great canvassing space with that 17 foot powered patio awning that does include LED lighting. Of course, throughout the coach, we use LED lighting which is 70% more energy efficient compared to normal incandescent or halogen lighting and doesn't heat up. You'll see not only is this compartment passed through, it's E-coded, but also you'll see on each of the cabinet doors and also compartment doors, an individual serialized component that allows us in the event that heaven forbid you have any body damage or you need a cabinet or compartment door sent, we can have one painted and sent out to you. Here you'll see the six gallon LP water heater with direct spark ignition. You'll also see there the 30,000 BTU low profile ducted furnace and a coaxial output to connect an outside TV along with this 110 volt duplex. Also on the outside of the coach, you'll see 76 pounds of LP capacity and then we can install a quick connect that allows you to power a gas grill. You'll see the dual rear wheels with the stainless steel wheel liners. These also include valve stem extensions. Here you'll see the 76 pound LP capacity. You can actually read this from outside using the analog gauge or inside in Winnebago's patented one place panel that we'll cover as we get inside the 26T. Pay attention to the lower threshold of entry. Therefore, we don't have to use an electric entry step, which can save you maintenance time and also maintenance cost. But again, great storage here in a 26T, even with dual slide outs. Typically, anytime you add a slide out, it sacrifices basement storage. As we work and zoom back, again, a 17 foot powered patio awning with LED lighting. We can also adjust the pitch on either one of these sides so that if you'd like to provide protection for sunsets or sunrises, we can accommodate that for you, but also then to fall off any morning dew or nominal rain away from your entry step. Within that entry door then, you'll see the radius cut coves, just like within a boat providing a tight seal. And then it also includes the screen door for great fresh air ventilation. An easy to access entry handle is provided right at hip height. And now as we work our way inside the 26T, we'll cover one sweeping shot of this floor plan and then we'll cover each of the main living areas in more detail. We've ordered this coach factory fresh in the all new contemporary linen interior with medium gray ultra fabrics, synthetic leather collection, along with the contemporary glazed driftwood cabinetry, all of which is handcrafted and vertically integrated produced here by Winnebago Industries that allows us to not only control tolerances and fit and finish, which long-term will minimize squeaks and rattles, we can also maximize storage using computer-aided design. A versatile floor plan that includes a large U-shaped dinette with three additional safety belts and converting into a 45 by 74 inch sleeping surface opposite the sofa bed, which includes an additional three safety belts and converts into a 40 by 60 inch sleeping surface a large wardrobe and pantry area with a traditional walk around queen bed that does also then include an expansive bath in one. Again, a walk around queen bed with great versatility in the nightstands and USB charge points, a pocket door for privacy to the master bedroom, a large L-shaped galley that does include the flip up countertop extension, an enormous split pantry for canned and heavier goods, a double door refrigerator and freezer that is both gas and electric. There you'll see the sofa bed with three safety belts and 
converts into a 40 by 60 inch sleeping surface and then overhead the fourth of four different sleeping surfaces at 57 by 95 inches. Again, throughout the RV with one seamless piece of upgraded bow floor vinyl flooring providing a contemporary laminate look, we set all of our cabinetry and appliances atop this to eliminate any risk of splitting compared to competing manufacturers that will seam that vinyl flooring in to trip themselves over pennies and nickels. You can literally Swiffer this coach out in a matter of seconds. Great versatility with a six foot, 10 inch interior ceiling height. LED lighting is used throughout the RV with the soft white glow. And now we'll cover each of the main living areas in the 26T in more detail. Inside the first of dual slide outs up top, a large bank of overhead glazed driftwood cabinetry with contemporary satin nickel poles and recessed LED lighting. You can see this has a higher sheen level with an 80 plus sheen level. Decorative window balances are included surrounding the MCD roller shade system. This is a traditional proprietary MCD shade system. Unlike other RV manufacturers that are using knockoff blinds such as slow rise blinds, these are the true proprietary MCD shades that revolutionized the industry back in 2010. They very simply glide up with a gentle pull and we can actually adjust a preset set height. So if you like them to recess to a certain location all of the time, we can accommodate that for you. Again, we do have the dual pane thermal insulated windows and the first of four different sleeping surfaces and relaxation areas with the sofa bed. This does include storage underneath. It includes three safety belts and converts into the first of four sleeping surfaces at 40 by 60 inches. This is the medium gray ultra fabrics collection with the synthetic leather, meaning you can be fairly aggressive in terms of how you clean it, but since it is synthetic leather, it's not so hot during the summer and not so cold during the winter. It provides a nice supple feel. Opposite this area then is a large U-lounge. This U-shaped dinette does include three safety belts. It includes storage underneath and the thermofoil table then drops down to provide a 45 by 74 inch sleeping surface. Again, up top, we have a full bank of glazed driftwood cabinetry with that 80 plus sheen level, a recessed mounted Sony Blu-ray player off to the left that we'll cover as we cover the infotainment area and the television AV area. But great storage over this large U-shaped dinette that does also include storage underneath. Here you can see the Sony HDMI equipped Blu-ray player. That then feeds the 32 inch high definition television that is on an articulating swivel mount in the overhead cab bed area. Again, nice supple leather, not so hot during the summer, not so cold during the winter. Another great feature to this tabletop is that it does rotate 360 degrees for ease of getting in and out of that large U lounge. It can also provide two chase loungers when that table is moved east to west, providing two different sofa areas. High endurance thermal foil countertop is included there for that table, but the kitchen and galley area include the DuPont high luster Corian solid surface countertops. Great lower back support and again, three safety belts. The coach does have a total of eight safety belts with the sofa bed and the U-shaped dinette in addition to the two in the overhead cab bed area. Equipped for today's connected social media, browsing, recharging all of those smartphones and tablets. We have USB charge points as well as a 110 volt outlet equipped right inside this large U-shaped dinette. The coach does include a 1000 watt pure sine wave inverter to power household appliances directly off of the dual deep cycle group 24 batteries to select outlets throughout the RV. A large L-shaped kitchen or galley area includes an enormous pantry with a large double door refrigerator and freezer. It is intentionally split in that pantry to 
equipped for heavier canned goods. Of course, we then include the driftwood inserts in this large double door refrigerator and freezer. And as we open up and take a spin through this fridge, let's cover specifications to the coach. This RV is 27 feet, one inch in length, tip to tip. It is a wide body at eight and a half feet and it's 11 feet tall to the most standard feature atop the roof. It includes a 50 gallon freshwater capacity, 39 gallons in the gray and 35 in the black. A 55 gallon fuel capacity provides for an estimated cruising range just under 600 miles. Again, with better fuel efficiency with the new Ford 7.3 liter V8. We'll work our way over now and cover the large split pantry. This does also include full length extension drawers, which are on metal drawer glides. Unlike competing manufacturers that still use plastic drawer glides and don't include full length extensions to save themselves nickels and dimes. Great storage here with all of these pull out drawers. There you also saw a serialized cabinet door again using computer aided design. This allows us then to provide parts for the long haul. All of our wiring here through Winnebago Industries is individually serialized, which provides for easier servicing. Working our way over then inside the main kitchen area. We do include high luster DuPont Corian countertops. Up top here, you'll also see the exhaust for the kitchen or galley area. Continuing on with that same glazed driftwood cabinetry, a large over the range microwave does also then include the rotisserie plate. A vented range hood with a recessed light area. Preset settings are also equipped in this large over the range microwave. You'll see off to the right, the attention to detail and the rich full style colored wallboard throughout the coach. You'll also notice inside the wardrobe cabinet closets and different areas. We use the same materials and don't try to save immaterial costs by seaming in a less quality wallboard compared to competing RV manufacturers. This also includes a large stainless steel sink off to the left and up top here a three burner range top with an innovative glass cooktop cover which allows for additional countertop space but also provides for a wonderful backsplash for easier cleaning down below a traditional lp oven allows you to bake brown and roast You'll see this recessed three burner range top right into the high luster Corian solid surface countertops. Heaven forbid in the event that you scratch or scrape or even take a nick out of one, we do have a licensed Corian technician here on staff at Litson RV, who is also a master RVIA certified trained technician that can actually wet sand that down since it is a solid surface countertop. A large stainless steel sink provides a large high rise satin nickel style gooseneck faucet with a pullout sink sprayer and a single control handle. Very easy to clean your dishes here in this large stainless steel bowl sink. We haven't forgotten the location for the waste paper basket underneath, additional drawer stacks and 110 volt outlets throughout. And again, these are all full length extensions with metal drawer glides, a full drawer stack with 110 volt outlet there also scattered throughout the coach. And exclusive to the 26T, a large flip up countertop extension provides for additional countertop space. Down below, you'll see the LP detector and then also taking advantage of that computer aided design, placing storage literally anywhere that we can for you, our guest, and also equipping with full length extension drawers for easier access to rearward items. So just great storage here in a nimble on the go length with the Mini Winnie and Spirit 26T. Nice rounded coves around that corner provide for easier access. Now working our way across then inside the step well, 
You'll see also additional storage with an easy to access entry handle, quick grab and go storage right near your entry door with the bound by the W hook off to the left and then great storage right above. Great place to place grab and go items right near your entry door. Additional storage then right behind that easy to access entry handle. A great location here for storing additional items. It does also include a clothing rod up top but adjust adjustable shelving here which can be used for quick shoe storage access. You can remove those shelves then and use it for coat storage. Also then included down inside this entry step are controls for the factory installed upgrade of the HWH automatic hydraulic leveling jacks. Controls for the 17 foot powered patio awning with LED lighting. These HWH computerized automatic hydraulic leveling jacks can be used in computerized automatic mode or individually run in pairs. They are so strong they can lift the coach up in the event that you have a roadside emergency, but also provide for great capability of maneuvering water runoff or cleansing and draining your tanks. You can also run those in individual mode. And again, they run in pairs because they are so powerful they could twist that metal chassis if run individually. You'll also see a disconnect switch there to put the dual deep cycle group 24 RV batteries in storage mode to ensure no parasitic draw. And then all of your 110 volt breakers and 12 volt breakers in one easy to access location intentionally mounted by the entry door. So you have that indirect light coming in from the outside in the event that you do have a breaker that has been thrown. Individual wall switches and then right above here, Winnebago's patented one place panel with all of your gauges in one easy to access location. Working our way up top here, we'll also cover the cold air intake for the Coleman Mach 15,000 BTU high efficiency ducted air conditioning system. This does include that easy to clean vinyl ceiling with the individual recessed LED lighting, controls for each of the two slide outs up top. Controls to start and stop the Cummins Onan 4000 watt micro quiet gasoline generator. Again, that sips fuel off of the top three quarters of the main 55 gallon fuel tank. It includes controls then for the direct spark ignition, electronic ignition, LP water heater, the 12 volt on demand water pump switch. Also controls for the 1000 watt pure sine wave inverter, allowing you to power household appliances directly off of the dual deep cycle group 24 RV batteries. You'll see controls for the heated drainage, which is a black and gray tank warming pad under each the 39 gallon gray tank and 35 gallon black tank. Also readouts for each of the tank levels and LP levels. A large wardrobe closet is included here. You'll see many of the accessories that ship with the coach and then also you'll see that same faux style colored wallboard in the rearward portion of the wardrobe closet. Again, using that same quality wallboard as opposed to seeming in less expensive materials like other competing RV manufacturers. A full length extension here also then with the foldable clothing drawers underneath the large wardrobe closet. You'll see the cold air intake for the 30,000 BTU low profile ducted furnace underneath that area, right in the main walkway. And again, for the master bedroom, a pocket door provides complete privacy. Here you'll see the thermostat for the 15,000 BTU high efficiency ducted air conditioning system, as well as the 30,000 BTU low profile ducted furnace. And then a nice shot there of the other side of the wardrobe closet. Individual wall switches are included throughout the RV. This is the Air XL Coleman Mach thermostat for the AC and for the furnace. A large expansive bath and one with an innovative pocket door provides great privacy inside this master bath and one. A large 24 by 32 inch shower with a one piece pan and a one piece surround that provides for easy maintenance and easy cleaning. You'll see overhead a 12 volt powered ventilator fan. And then also inside the master bathroom shower, 
you'll see a flexible handheld shower head that allows you to start and stop the water both on the head as well as on the faucet to conserve water when RVing off the grid. And then overhead, a wonderful overhead skylight provides for beautiful indirect lighting as well as additional height clearance for our taller guests. Again, keep in mind the coach does have a maximum six foot 10 inch interior ceiling height. And what everybody raves about is the disappearing shower door. What's great about this is it minimizes maintenance because it literally squeegees the water off as the door is recessed in. But easy to access with molded areas. Putting in a, a shower door that will squeegee the water off as it recesses. An innovative pocket door also provides privacy inside the master bath. This includes a residential height style toilet with a modified elongated bowl with a foot pedal flush. Many of the accessories that other RV manufacturers force you to go out and purchase are included standard, including tissue holders, robe hooks, and towel bars. It also includes a mirrored area and medicine cabinet as well as the lavatory cabinet. Again, great lighting inside this master bath. Nice medicine cabinet there. Again, with that same wallboard material. Includes the robe hooks and towel bars. Sliding over, then you'll also see the thermofoil countertop along with the dual control lavatory faucet and undermounted easy to clean acrylic style sink. Of course, we haven't forgotten the location for the waste paper basket inside the master bath. And inside the master bath, we also include additional ducting and additional ducting overhead for both hot and cooling areas. Great storage underneath. And then also off to the left, a GFI protected 110 volt outlet. And then also an additional medicine cabinet area that can also be used for linens, wall switches for the overhead lighting. One of the unique things about this pocket door is it not only slides north south, but then also partitions out and uses that magnetic catch so it provides easier access of entering that master bath. Within the master bedroom, a full bank of overhead glazed driftwood cabinets continue with LED lighting. We continue with the dual pane thermal insulated windows and also include side windows on each side of the walk around queen bed. Provides great fresh air ventilation, especially in conjunction with the rear master bedroom vent. This is a true walk around queen bed. It includes a beautiful picture window that is hinged for emergency exit out the rear. And again, all of these are dual pane thermal insulated windows. Nightstands are on each side along with 110 volt outlets and USB charge points. So it can be configured for use with a CPAP or BPAP machine. You'll see a 110 volt outlet and then also a USB charge point on each side. Of course, everybody sleeps next to their smartphone or tablet, so you can recharge that throughout a restful night over this walk around queen bed. This includes a foam mattress, headboard, and then also the mattress covering. 12 volt and USB charge points are included on this side of the bed along with a 110 volt outlet. This is a true walk around queen bed at 60 by 75 inches. It is housed within that second slide out. So again, a nimble on the go length with dual slide outs and a tremendous amount of basement storage. To the rear then we also include another high definition television. This is a 24 inch high definition television. We continue with the same decorative window coverings and MCD roller shade system. Again, with all of these window valances and all of this vertical integration, nearly 80% of the components are made in-house versus outsourcing to companies, primarily based in the Midwest out of Elkhart where most suppliers are. 
We choose here instead to build here within Forest City, knowing that parts will be available for years to come, precisely engineering what is needed, making it fit where we want to control tolerances and fit and finish, but also to distribute weight more evenly, which provides for better handling. Using the spin weld process for all of our holding tanks and compartments, providing maximum exterior storage. And now as we work our way back up front, we'll wrap up in the main cab and overhead cab sleeping area. A vent is included up top along with additional heating, ventilation, and air conditioning inside this overhead cab bed, which is 57 by 95 inches. It provides ease of access into the cockpit with the portion that slides out. This very simply pulls down to convert a 57 by 95 inch sleeping surface. Again, with the same firm foam material built in-house by Winnebago Industries. It includes the side window off to the driver's side for great fresh air ventilation, the same decorative window balance, an MCD shade, a privacy curtain, and a bunk ladder if needed to jump up atop that 57 by 95 inch sleeping surface. And then again, that 32 inch high definition television does articulate out for viewing from either the sofa bed, the U lounge, or from the overhead cab sleeping area. And then locks into the patio side sidewall in transit to ensure no rattling. Working our way then down inside the new Ford cockpit. We covered many of these components during the walkthrough of the new chassis. The cab seats feature armrest, fixed lumbar support, and a multi-adjustable slide and recline. We include light duty automotive conveniences such as tilt and telescoping steering, along with easy to control thumb wheel steering wheel controls power door locks, power windows, tilt and cruise control. You can see there the keyless entry for the new Ford chassis. Controls for the instrumentation cluster off to the left, including controls to articulate the adaptive cruise control, active distance alerts, forward collision alerts, and lane departure warning system. Controls for the powered mirrors with defrost, an all new LCD based instrumentation cluster. Controls then down below for the cruise control, hands free calling off to the right, and controls for the infotainment radio off in the upper right hand component. And then again, dual front airbags and also tilt and telescoping steering. A nice bright anti-glare instrumentation cluster, which is customizable in terms of the layout. You'll see controls for the six-speed automatic transmission with select shift capability, which also includes tow haul mode. It also then provides the capability for grade braking. Off to the right, you'll see the battery boost switch. This allows you to jumpstart the Ford chassis off of the RV batteries in the event that your chassis battery gets low complete heating, ventilation, and air conditioning controls, but then also this all new Sony 8.95 inch infotainment radio that does include Sirius XM satellite radio as the factory installed upgrade, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, a color rear view camera monitoring system, Bluetooth hands-free calling, Bluetooth music replay for audio apps such as Spotify, Pandora, Radio App One, or any MP3 downloads that you may have directly on your smart device but also hands-free GPS commands through Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. And this Sony infotainment radio does come back with a three-year warranty. The Ford Motor Company warranty is five years or 60,000 miles on the extended powertrain, three or 36 on the bumper to bumper. Winnebago provides a 10-year warranty on the roof, a three or 36 on the slide outs, the subfloor, the sidewalls, which do include the premium high gloss skin. So the slide out the subfloor, the sidewalls and the structure, each appliance manufacturer's warranty is anywhere from one to three years. And then Winnebago wraps its inputs for fit and finish for one year or 15,000 miles.
Now, as we wrap up in the infotainment radio here, we'll also cover the color rear view camera monitoring system. And again, it does include the side video camera monitoring system, which is completely articulated by the turn signal column. But it can be individually controlled for a total of three dedicated security cameras. Some great settings are customizable inside and then down below you'll see controls for the lane departure warning system, the hazard lighting, complete heating, ventilation and air conditioning controls, as well as the passenger side airbag cutoff if you're traveling solo with pets. You'll see multiple USB and USB-C charge points located right below that hazard and lane departure warning switch. The trim line console provides ease of access for entering the cockpit and exiting the cockpit. Multiple cup holders are included, controls for the traction control, 12 volt power points, additional USB charge points, and then again that passenger airbag cutoff switch. Great storage is also included underneath and then in each of the side doors. But even though that is a trim line console for ease of access, provides some great cup holder storage as well as additional USB and also microphone controls. You'll see easy access or doghouse to the 7.3 liter V8. An easy to clean walkway surface is included. And then again, you can recline that seat deeper into the U-Lounge by dropping that cushion. And as we swivel around, we'll cover one last sweeping shot as I want to take this opportunity to thank you for visiting Litson RV and for the opportunity to showcase for you the all new safety enhanced Winnebago Mini Winnie and Spirit 26T available here at Litson RV, America's closest dealer to Winnebago Industries. We're located only one mile north of the Winnebago factory based right here in Forest City, Iowa, and recently named by the manufacturer of Winnebago Industries as the North American top dealer for sales volume across all of the motorized coach divisions of Winnebago Industries, based right here in Forest City, Iowa. But reaching out across all of North America for that top sales volume award now for the past five consecutive years. However, most importantly, be the first to break in and protect your new Ford 7.3 powertrain in accordance with the way Ford Motor Company outlines inside their owner's manuals in which there certainly is a definitive break-in procedure in which they recommend, if possible, no towing for the first thousand miles and varying your speeds to break in and seat those cylinders in that Ford 7.3 liter V8 as opposed to the way a delivery driver may and do tow their own personal vehicle out to your local dealership, be the first to break in that new powertrain, sleep that first night in your walk around queen bed and eat your first meal in your factory fresh 26T available here at Litson RV. Thank you for visiting Litson RV here in Forest City, Iowa, the home of Winnebago Industries. I'm Ron Litson and I wanna thank you for visiting our dealership here in Forest City, Iowa. Here are some great points from the Litson RV team as to points unrelated to price why you should experience the best here at Litson RV. New motorhomes from Litson RV have no delivery miles on them. We do not use delivery services like other dealers in which drivers live in the RV during transportation or tow their own personal vehicle during the crucial engine break-in period. There are no additional fees with purchasing in the state of Iowa, as a customer will pay their tax, title, and license in which the state that they register their RV. However, we do help in assisting titling your RV in your home state. As you can see, we help people day in and day out all over the United States and Canada with titling their motorhome. Due to our close proximity to Winnebago factory, we're able to take advantage of cost savings over other RV dealerships. This allows us to provide you with low, no hassle pricing. We offer free, thorough walk-arounds with our guests at the time of delivery, where we take as much time as needed for our guests to understand every function, maintenance, and warranty item of their RV. Many dealers charge a significant sum to provide this service. Here at Litson RV, we provide our guests the opportunity to stay on our lot while enjoying free access to Wi-Fi, filter fresh water, and electrical hookups, whether they're here to take delivery of their new RV or just passing through for service. We work with several different lenders in order to secure you the most competitive rates and terms. We also offer insurance from several different insurance carriers such as Progressive and Nationwide. 
Purchase and service your RV and experience the best at Litson RV, the nation's closest dealer to Winnebago Industries, based right here in Forest City, Iowa.